What's going on today, everybody? How you doing? Hopefully, you checked out the previous video. Those are three S coins you don't want to miss out on. But now, for the traders out there looking for the uh, the leverage trades, also you can leverage these th this particular token on KuCoin. Um, not financial advice, not a recommendation, because it is risky, highly risky. But with great risk comes great rewards. Anyways, we're gonna be taking a look and uh, kind of an update video on Filecoin, because Filecoin actually has what looks to be support, found it, finally, found it. However, don't get it twisted. We're gonna look at Bitcoin. Um, Bitcoin could possibly take one more drop. Anyways, we're on the road to 1K subscribers and trying to get this channel monetized. If you could do me a huge favor, hit the like, hit the subscribe, hit the bell, because all of these videos are time sensitive, considering they are trade setups. Anyways, without further ado, let's go into the uh, TA here. So we are on the daily for Filecoin. You can see we have been in this downtrend here. For a long time. We've been in it ever since March 29th. Just fallen. I mean, at first we were like, hey, cool. We're kind of like having a bull flag before a rally up. And then all of a sudden we're like, but the bull flag keeps going. And then it kept going and we're like, are we going to stop? You know what? We finally did. We finally stopped down here uh, March, or April 26th. Okay, we, we finally stopped. Now we're starting to see a little bit of bullish momentum. We still have this mini downtrend here. We got to consider because guess what? We're hitting it again and we're finding resistance on it. However, I do think it is finally going to stop holding us down in the short term. We're actually starting to rally just a little bit. We are up 1.95% on the day. I know in crypto, it's like 1.95%. Let's go to sleep because that's nothing. I feel you. I feel you. Anyways, let's go down to the... Oh, um, looking at the daily, you can see bullish divergence is forming. This thing, at any point in time, could converge bullish. We could see the stochastic RSI curve to the upside. We could also see the relative strength index go from oversold into a decent area. We could see this out of Filecoin. You can see we're also bouncing along the bottom. Bounce along the bottom. You know, if we were fishing, we're going for halibut down here. I mean, they're yeah anyways uh let's go to the four hour time frame so we can see a little bit more data so on the four hour time frame remember that that little pesky resistance i was talking about that was holding us down well guess what we did break above it and now we're back testing it as support this is a very good sign this is why you turn on those notification bells so you can get notified as soon as i upload these videos heck some of you even join the discord so you can get notified in the discord you, you can even get notified when I go live on Twitch. Follow me on Twitch. Shameless plug. Anyways, as we can see, uh, bullish divergence is slowly playing out. Very decrepitly slow. But on the 4-hour time frame, we do have triple bullish divergence. Uh, are you this little area? Maybe quadruple? I don't know. But bullish momentum is coming up. We can also see the relative strength index is finally starting to get into positive territory, which is phenomenal anyways we are looking at higher prices we actually broke back above this resistance at 1776 we hit the top which was now resistance former support at 1845 we came back down just to just for good measure we had to back test the former resistance as support and we did that we back tested both of them as support which is getting bought up as we speak perfect we are above the 20 ema on the four hour now we just need to start working our way up through all these other emas and finally get back up to possibly 1981 that is the real price target i have a profit taking level right here because i did go very high on my leverage and that will mark out 150 percent gains for me anyways um, that's what I'm seeing out of Filecoin, especially on the 4-hour. I do think we are going to see this trade play out in the next day or two. And uh, past that, we need to see Bitcoin. So Bitcoin, it, it's looking interesting. It's looking interesting. 
you know, we're still in this little trading channel. We have a bullish engulfing candle on the four hour. We're above the 50 EMA, trying to use it as support on the four hour. We are currently back into the buying zone on the four hour. We are about to back test it as support, which we love to see. I still believe Bitcoin will get to the top of this trading channel. And once we get up there, we'll see what happens. I mean, it could either be a dump all the way back down to the bottom, down here at like 38,000. Or we could finally get that short squeeze we've been looking for. And this short squeeze will be massive. Because if you if you take any time to look at the metrics or look at the shorts that are stacking up on Bitcoin, it's going to be massive. And that's how we could end up seeing Bitcoin literally like a rocket shoot up to 47.1 almost instantly. Anyways, Bitcoin's looking bullish. Therefore, file token looks bullish. All the other altcoins are looking very bullish, but without further ado, I hope you all check out the links down below. Give me a follow. Make sure you hit the subscribe. Make sure you get notified every time I go live on Twitch by joining Discord or following me on Twitter. Anyways, have a great day. Keep those stop losses tight, and I will catch you in the next one. Peace.